Hey Adrian, here's the demo of the peer-to-peer -peer encrypted private message chat system. So I'm going to create a username, password to go with it. It's going to log me in, generate public private key pair for me to use. I'm going to create another user. Once I am signed in, I'm going to grab the public key that in and you'll see it pops up that yes it is indeed Amber Gazelle who I want to talk with. I'm going to grab this key, pop that in there, it is indeed Mark Nadal that I want to talk to. Hello world instantly opens up over there and I can see the message. Hey you back and we got fully intend encrypted data. Now of course on your screen it doesn't look like it is encrypted because it's automatically decrypting it for you. I'm going to pull up what the data looks like at disk. So here is local storage. If we pull into one of these public keys, we have a couple necessary properties on object. One of them is um, not necessary. It's the chat object, and that's just the application data. The chat object winds up pointing to a certain key right here, LQ. I pull up LQ and it winds up just pointing to another table, which is uh, WEA. So now once we pull up WEA, this is where the data is actually encrypted right here. So this message right here is the hello world or the hey you back and at rest on disk and over the transport layer or the network, that data is encrypted so nobody else is able to read it. That's all. Just wanted to do a quick video. It's a little bit past midnight right now, and I'll probably follow up with text on how the actual code works. It's only 75 lines of code. All right, thanks. I'll chat with you later.